G'day guys and welcome back to Hi-Fi Rush where uh, we're continuing our expedition here back into production. The previous episode was an interesting one. We uh, <laughs> definitely learnt the hard way uh, of various mechanics. But uh, anyway, without further ado, let's just keep going and see if we can find what's going on next. I'm assuming there's some form of boss that we're going to be having to fight against here. But uh, anyway, well, we'll find out shortly, I'm sure. Now, let's see what kind of goodies we can find here. Okay. Ooh, okay, so we've got a complete life gauge there. So, maximum health increased. I assume it just increases automatically? Let's just quickly check here. Yeah, I think so, because we've gone back to zero. I don't actually see any other items there, so... we probably just use it automatically. Now, uh... I mean, if you're watching, guys, and you've uh, seen any other playthroughs, uh, you guys can maybe let me know, does the chest offer better rewards if you sort of fill the bar completely? I assume it does. Pep up, Chai. We're almost there. Oh, well, I guess your whole get to Rekka's office without her knowing plan is shot. Thanks to you! Hey, hey, who is doing all the hard work here? Uh, it wouldn't be so hard if you just listened to me to begin with. <laughs> well, she's got a point. We did decide to do things the cool way, didn't we? Um, anyway, let's go. For all workers who haven't yet entered the lottery for Armstrong Festival tickets, now's your chance. You won't want to miss this show. Okay, that's a first. Uh, well, I mean, we did see Mimosa in a, uh, a cutscene, but uh, anyway. These pigeons are the source of my discontent. I desire assistance in ridding of them from my cleaning area. Think you can help out, Peppermint? Hmm, pigeons. Okay. Let's see. Uh. Try this out. Light up. There we go. Uh, any other pigeons? I think that's it. Pigeons are too far. Perhaps distant force is required. Ah. Here's some more. Peppermint. You call? And I think there's one more group of pigeons, apparently. Pigeons are too far. Perhaps distant force is required. So there are pigeons over there. Ah, there we go. Your turn, Peppermint. Try this out. Nice. Okay. I wonder if there are other submissions in various locations. My discontent is gone. This treasure is yours. I do the work and you get the prize. How nice. Nice! Nice indeed. Alright. Let's keep going. Now I did watch the previous episode again, guys, and I realized that I probably missed, uh, like one huge chunk of gears in, uh, one particular location, so <laughs> apologies. It's bound to happen again, I'm sure. Nice, that was pretty good, actually. I'm finding it a lot easier now that I've got Peppermint in the mix as well. Okay. 
Alright. Still can't seem to work things out as best as I could here, so uh, let's again dive in. So we did really, really well in the first round. Okay, not bad. Uh, you know what? Bad guys. <laughs> Nice. Okay, I need to try the combo with Peppermint, actually. Okay, still haven't been able to actually get the combo off with Peppermint. Um, I'm trying to actually remember how to do that even. So let me just have a look at the combo list once more here. So, um... Uh, partner attacks, perhaps. So blaster... When landing a beat hit on a ground combo. Can't be used during cooldown. Peppermint Blaster. Okay. Um, I think we only purchased one and it has to be a ground combo. So we just substitute the attack button with the RT button, right? So anyway, we'll try and get it in the next one. Let's see how we go. This is it. Just play it cool. Okay, so it looks like we're in perhaps Rekka's office. So uh, let's see what's going on. We'll uh, do a little bit of exploring. Bunch of scrubs doing their thing. Let's just bust this thing. Let's actually try the combo here. There we go. Alright, uh, what's going on here? I know this may get me in trouble, but I think that is the love of my life right there. Oh, unrequited love. Our work agreement forbids it. <laughs> Let's see. Who is he looking at? Ah, this uh, robot over here. Let's have a read of this. Behind the showmanship. Sit down with Rekka. Excerpt from exclusive interview with Vandalay Technology production head Rekka. 
The output Vandalay has seen lately has been staggeringly impressive. It ain't enough. Well, I don't know how you can compete with an over sorry with an average 300% production increase every quarter for the past five years and you think that's good Reckel say it again it ain't enough but that's why you're just writing articles and not standing where Reka is Ooh, bit uh, <laughs> selfish much um, it was a compliment miss ow did you just slap me in the face Rekka sure did, and she'll do it again if you throw another miss in there. You can't just go around slapping reporters. Rekka does what Rekka wants, and once Project Armstrong takes the world by, straw by storm, you'll be asking for slaps just to get another interview. <laughs> She's uh, overconfident, that's for sure. Does uh, Scrub say anything else? The longer I stay here, the stranger I may seem. I must make my move. Uh, will he actually make his move? Oh no, we can't actually speak to him again. Let's quickly check back here. More stuff. Always like more stuff. Current waiting time for appointment with Rekka is three months. You're free to have a seat until then. <laughs> uh, typical. Bigger. Stronger. Is this promo for Rekka, or motivation for the rest of us? I'm trying to make this a better place to work, and look at you. Showing off. Is this MHR matter? Figures you don't see it. You think this encourages them? Nah. It's just a reminder. You don't have what it takes. The workers here need to know. They ain't ever getting out of that hole they dug themselves into. This world is sick. Dark. Sad. But we are supposed to help. Help? Impossible. We just mask the reality, give an illusion we care. We can't change anything. The cards are stacked too high against us. This poster stays. It says the truth. Wow. <laughs> Things just got real edgy. Um, Vandalay, stronger, bigger. Mm, nice. Uh, we'll take those batteries, thank you very much. Ah, uh, here we go. Pretty quiet. Not suspicious at all. Introducing. Hmm? <laughs> okay, in the flesh this time. You want to be successful? You want to be productive? Huh? Then you got to be aggressive. And when a defect punk like you wants to run out of here, you're just asking for it. Asking for what exactly? You disrespecting me? That's it. The gloves are coming off. I can see that. What was your plan for this, Peppermint? I don't know. Fight? <clears throat> You're paying me double for this. But I'm not paying you anything. Hey! Hmm? I'm the main show here! <clears throat> so let's get ready to crumble. <clears throat> Woo! Come on! Okay, um, finally, we're fighting Rekka herself, not some other robot. Uh, I do apologize guys, we had a little bit of a stuttering issue there and uh, the timing of that, uh, I guess, cutscene went a little bit off, so, uh... Okay. 
Okay, ran into that one. I'm guessing this is going to be pretty painful, but, uh... Wow, okay, that that's really bad. So I need to figure out how to actually dodge this uh, attack. And I assume I can't actually attack her while she's uh, electrified as well. Yeah, okay. Definitely not working. Ah, uh, no one missed damn it. With the big boss. All right, let's try that again. Okay, getting greedy there. Ow! Okay. Well, at least it doesn't do too much damage, but it definitely does a lot of stun damage. I think maybe it's better to use Peppermint while she's electrified. Damn it. Push it up. How do you like this, Rekka? That all you got? Here we go. Don't hold back. You ain't gonna ruin this company's rep. You're going out with the trash. Oh, okay. Okay, was not expecting that at all, guys. <laughs> Oh, wow. Okay. You get Rekka angry and you pay the price, punk. All right, let's try this again. Let's go. Help me. 
Damn it. You pay. Do that for me. Get her, guy. Ooh, okay. Here we go. How do you like this, Rekka? Okay, final phase. Ah, oh, damn it! Oh, oh, oh. You gave Rick a rush! This is how you get it done! Oh man, I am getting my ass kicked! Alright, let's try this one more time. Okay, I have no idea how to dodge this one, but we'll uh, try our best. Okay, finally. <laughs> You're down for the count, big boss. You think I'll lose to a punk like you? Yeah, that sounds about right. Do you reckon that will leave a mark? Okay, B. That, that's pretty horrendous, but that's okay. We got through. That's what counts. <laughs> cool. Her personal pass key. Great job, Jai. Huh? Mm. Crazy! Looks like we found our AI. This is a screensaver, Jai. <laughs> huh? Wait. Spectra is designed to interface with user perception and reasoning? This gives Vandalay direct access to people's minds. Make 
make that thing stop? I'm trying to concentrate. Uh, what did you just do? You said make it stop. Rucka, please tell me you've dealt with the defect. What in the hell am I looking at? The name's Chai, not Defect. Where's Rekka? Hmm. Oh, haven't you heard? I better start looking for a new production head. Is this some sort of joke? Oh, now this is a juicy meeting. <laughs> He's <laughs> muted. Zanzo, I think you're muted, honey. <laughs> I was going to say... Corsica, get your people to production right away. Oh, uh, y yes, sir. <laughs> Go ahead. Send whatever you want. See this? Peppermint and I are going to kick your ass with your own tech. Peppermint? And if that's not enough, check out my arm. I can make a guitar and slam it down. And... <laughs> you idiot. Ow, 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 Come on. Ow, 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 ow. <laughs> <laughs> All right, very nice. Well, I mean, rank D is probably not really that nice, but <laughs> you know what I'm getting at, guys. Uh, and uh, that bit about the uh, the guy being on mute, I mean, that, that hits way too close to home. <laughs> not even an apology, Chai, for getting the job done? Are you that dumb? Now they know me. No, you're not acting alone. And... Oh, secrecy is blown. I have to rethink my whole plan. There was a plan? What? Okay, I might have been on a power trip. I am sorry. But you got your data, right? Spectra? The data that said Vandalay can basically mind control you? I wasn't really listening. <sighs> Just check this out. <sighs> hey! Whoa, what are you... It syncs with Project Armstrong interfaces. Try it on yourself! This is an Armstrong tech. I got the smudges on my arm. Ah, it's not coming off. And with just a simple command... Don't you think that you were right all this time and I'm a stubborn loser? Also, Peppermint is way cooler than me. Oh, yo! What the... Still doubting? But you made me say that. Couldn't Vandalay have designed this for, you know, research or something? Only you wouldn't find this suspicious. The point is, they can. And I need to stop that. Well, I wish you good luck. Chai. <laughs> but I have no idea how to get off this island and feel a little responsible for messing things up. Great. You're hereby a member of my organization. Cool, cool. Our own little weird indie three-piece. Hey, uh, Chai, before you head out, I want to show you something I was working on. What now? All right, here we are, back at the hideout. Uh, let's just quickly look around, shall we? Uh, just in case anything has sort of changed in this area. It doesn't look like it. Let's just take a quick look at the challenges board. Okay, so we definitely get rewards from completing all of these challenges here. So we could actually just gather the gears here. So we've got 4,000 gears thanks to defeating 50 out of 50 enemies. So we should actually check back on this board every now and then just to collect the, uh, the gears that are rewarded to us. Uh, I don't know how many of these challenges we might be able to complete by the end of the... Uh, the playthrough <laughs> and I must admit I feel like I'm not doing a very good job I mean I'm dying a whole heap I am playing on the hardest not wait actually no this is not the hardest difficulty but it is a hard difficulty uh, so it is I guess a little bit more challenging than usual 
and uh, I haven't played the game before either, so <laughs> I'm really not making this easy for myself, am I? It's all right. I'll uh, we'll keep going. It's a uh, it's a bit painful, but it's a it's a good kind of rewarding pain, if that makes sense. Sort of like playing Dark Souls, you know. As they say in Dark Soul Souls, it's uh, you have to just get good. Um, Oh, wow, okay, broken Armstrong circuits? What are those? I mean, I have no idea, but uh, anyway. Do a combo. Ah, okay, so this is just like, oh, have you ever done these things? Hmm. Does it actually mark which ones have actually been completed? Yes, okay. Here we go. Let's grab that. I wish you can maybe filter these by, you know, things that you can actually collect. Battle items. Ah, oh, okay, right. I'm actually going backwards. So, let's just scan the entire list here. Nice. Okay. I think that's everything. Just quickly check around this area. Nothing new. Is this any different? No. Nope. Uh, it's just the... Uh, transcript of all of those uh, data pads that we've actually found. Let's have a chat with Peppermint. So it looks like I can modify your energy source to micromanage your abilities. I don't need help. I know you want to be a rock star, but we need to work together. So, this is what I was working on. They're custom chips to boost some of your abilities. Ooh. Sounds cool. Custom chips. With a few broken Armstrong parts, I can make you passive skills. I went ahead and made you one on the house. Cuts down the time needed to call me in during battle. Okay, decrease peppermint recharge time by 12.5%. all about you. Sounds pretty good, actually. Uh, anyway, you'll need to equip these for them to take effect. Okay. Ah, okay, LT. Right now, you don't have many slots to work with, but with some upgrades, you can mix and match skills. Nice. So, bring me back any Armstrong parts you find, would ya? I'll keep an eye out. Keep an eye out for Armstrong circuits when exploring. So this is the thing that we just saw before. Collecting a few will allow you to create new, sh uh, new chips. Upgrade Chai to have more slots for chips. Using multiple chips and combining enhancements can customize Chai's abilities to your playstyle. And hopefully make me die less. <laughs> anyway, let's uh, take a look at what we can buy here. And maybe we should just sort of uh, do our buying and spending right now before we uh, sort of wrap things up for this episode. And then we'll get straight into it in the next one. Shred. Uh, mash. Why? Okay, that... Seems pretty cool, actually. We will get that. And that's quite cheap as well. Quick beat hit. Uh, X and A. Okay, right. So you just press that together and you just get a beat hit immediately. That seems pretty decent. Magnet backstab. So, LB when reaching the grabbed enemy. Okay, interesting. Um, I don't know, it might make things a little bit more complicated for us. Let's go back to Peppermint here, Cannon Spike. Old RT release to activate. Ooh, okay. Yes please. When landing a beat hit in the air. Yeah, let's go with that. And uh, special attacks. I think we'll go with the pick-me-up guys, <laughs> because I've been doing so horribly when it comes to uh, especially the bosses. 
and those armored uh, enemies. So I think anything that's going to let us sort of recover our health a little bit is really welcome. Uh, how do I actually equip that? Let me just uh, take a quick look at our uh, special attacks here. Okay, required reverb gauges too. Uh, so with special attacks, don't you have to equip them? And I'm um, struggling to remember how to equip special attacks. But uh, mm, anyway, we might have to sort of figure that out another day. Uh, I might actually figure it out before we go into the next episode, actually. Ah, we have a training room here as well. Who knows, guys? I might do a little bit of training before I come back to the next episode because I am doing so horribly, so <laughs> perhaps maybe I can sort of devise some strategies in the training room. Let's uh, quickly talk to Peppermint here. What else do you want? So you hacked into me with Project Armstrong. What did you, uh, see in there? Actually, I thought it was strange. I couldn't see anything. <laughs> Is this another one of your you're so stupid chai digs? As much as I enjoy those, no. There's no data collection in this code. So, Vandalay doesn't care about me personally. Unusual for a tech corporation. All this seems to do is input information. This is all very suspicious. Right, Peppermint? <sighs> yes, Chai, it is. Hence, why we need more information. Crazy to see all the Vandalay top brass in one place. Well, minus Rekka, you can say. Well, she was partially there. And you sure made that known. Had to let them know who was in charge. They are, Chai. Don't forget that. It's us versus the entire company now. But they don't have us. What? Look, we're outnumbered. Just don't forget that. Really cool of you to, you know, hide the fact that you can teleport. Well, while you were smashing up production, I was here working out how to do that. So how does it even work? Like I said, it's complicated. Basically, whatever bond you created with 808 puts out a digital signal I can hijack. So that means you can teleport me back here whenever you want. You and 808 are the antenna, I just latch on. Doesn't work the other way around. But what if I were to stand next to a wall? Chai, just stop. Don't think too deeply about this. All right, very cool. Okay guys, I think we've done enough prep before we go into the next mission, but uh, it is a pretty good place for a bit of a break, so I'm going to take it. Hope you enjoyed this one. Leave a like, dislike, or a comment or two down below. Stay true, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.